I know it's been a long time since you've seen my face. I've posted a couple of shorts and a couple of things on YouTube and Instagram. And I just want to come on here and apologize and give a little bit of an explanation of where we have been the last couple of months. Uh, the last video I posted was about two and a half months ago from our trip to Rome. There are three more videos in that series that I need to complete. I haven't had the opportunity to finish um, and I'll explain why. So after we got back from Italy, we were we had such an amazing time in Italy and I was so looking forward to going through all the video and the pictures and sharing all of that with you. However, as I started to go through some of it, I became a little demotivated. A lot of the footage that I shot didn't really come out the way I wanted to. Uh, I wasn't happy with the voiceover, with the, the talking part of it. I didn't really do a great job of explaining what we were doing, where we were, things like that. So I became a little demotivated and I decided to put a, a halt on making videos. I would, I would pick at it occasionally seeing if I could fix it, but I just wasn't able to create something that I was satisfied with. That, that was one aspect of it. Um, another aspect of it was, this part's really hard for me to explain um, and say it out loud. Uh, as, as YouTube creators, uh, we use certain communities and forums to get ideas and, and help kind of encourage each other. I had gone on a forum to get feedback on my channel and my videos, some creative feedback so I can see, you know, what I could fix, what I could change, what I need to do better, what I'm doing good, and so on. What I wasn't expecting was this comment saying essentially that all I'm doing is posting my vacation videos and it has no substance. That, even though that's the critique I was kind of looking for, it, it, it was a realization for me. Um, a lot of the videos that we make are essentially just videos of my vacations. Um, I started this channel with the intent of helping people learn how to travel, learn how to budget for travel, and learn kind of to stop being so scared of traveling so you can all get out and do it and enjoy it as much as we do. So that comment, though factual, hit me very hard. So I, I stopped wanting to do that. I stopped wanting to just post beautiful scenery footage and of us walking and stuff like that. So that that's what's taken me so long. Uh, I know there's a lot of travel content creators that do pretty much the same thing and, you know, they don't have a lot of substance. It's just them wandering around, you know, showing the things they did and they don't get flack for it. So um, I was a little torn and I've gotten back in the routine. Um, as you may have noticed behind me, this office looks a little different. Um, we've never really shot a lot of studio type of work because the office we were using before was a very small room, not a lot of not a lot of space for anything. So um, this is another reason why it's taken us so long is we took a spare bedroom and we have converted it. So there's a lot more space for for decorations, a bigger desk, Ashley's desk, there's more room that you can't see this way. I've got my camera collection, like it's just a bigger room and it's just better for stuff like this. So that that took us a while to, to convert the spare bedroom, planned other trips. We've got a, a huge trip coming up in 2024. Uh, we did a couple of weekend things here and there. So all of that combined is where I have been, you will be happy to know that with this newfound creative inspiration that I have come across, I think it has something to do with creating the studio space and making it feel a little more official than me just posting random phone clips from my, my other room. It, it helped bring back some of the, the creative motivation that I was requiring. So that that really helped. I've been going through all the footage from uh, the rest of Rome and the Vatican City and Venice. And then we have some Iceland video to go through. 
I'm also really far behind because I've got an entire cruise that we've taken that I have not even posted anything about. That was one of the, probably one of the coolest cruises I've been on too with the MSC Yacht Club uh, and that whole experience. So I've got that to work on too. And I've got to do all of this before August because in August we are going to be taking kind of the next level type of cruise, which is a Norwegian fjord cruise. That is a big deal because we have to fly all the way to England and then we're going to cruise up and then come back down. Uh, us, us American cruisers, we're used to just going to the Caribbean, Bermuda, Alaska. For us, huge deal. And I'm so looking forward to going to Norway and seeing all the fjords and the waterfalls and hopefully some northern lights, but I'm not sure. Yeah, that's going to be a great experience. And then we've also been revamping a lot of our strategy for recording. And, you know, typically Ashley and I, we just record whatever whatever we see, whatever we're doing, we just record it all. So, and that made, because we didn't know really what, we just wanted to capture it all. But that really made it difficult when it comes to the editing aspect of it. I had so much files to go through and so much footage to go through that it, it just became a jumbled mess. Ashley and I have a new strategy for when we go to Norway. And this way, when we come back, or when I start posting it, it'll be super easy, super organized. There'll be a lot more structured content. It won't just be mostly B-roll and then some talking in the background. So hopefully we'll be able to bring you some of the best videos that we've ever done. To the 400 or so of you who have stuck around with me throughout this time or that I've grown with or whatever, I do greatly appreciate all of the the patience and, and sticking around and liking all the videos and watching all the videos. Some of the videos have done really well, some of them not so well. As a content creator, this is this is very not normal for me, but I'm I'm trying really, really hard to be more to be more myself on camera. As a 20-year photographer, I'm so used to being behind the camera, not talking, and just shooting what I love. So doing this is a lot more difficult and a lot more different than I'm used to, but it is a process. And Ashley as well, she's also a, a new photographer, you know, she's she's really good. Some of those pictures up there are hers, I believe. So she's really, really a good photographer, but again, with video and on-screen talking, it's, it's all new to us. So we appreciate you sticking around and we're just gonna continue to grow when this grows to be what I want it to be, then we can do even more amazing things. So that's where we've been, that's what we're doing, and that is where we are going. So that being said, thank you guys so much again for liking and subscribing these videos. If you just found this channel with this video, uh, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it if you gave us one of those likes and subscribes and little notification bells so you can get notified when I do post new videos because I assure you some of the best ones are coming up. I just have to go through it and make them right. <laughs> I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Keep traveling and we will see you in the next one. Bye.